Welcome back. The community is pulling together to get results. After we brought you this story earlier this week, a Deltona Girl Scout had her money stolen while she was selling cookies. Some parents are still outraged behind this story, but you know what? Things have actually turned around since this weekend. News 6 reporter Johnny Fernandez has more on the donations rolling in for these girls. Today, I'm at Mix 105.1, getting results for a local Girl Scout after someone stole her money box at a local Walmart. This is the guy parents and deputies want to catch after he stole $300 from a Deltona Girl Scout troop. We brought you this story earlier this week, and the donations to help the troop out have been enormous. It makes us feel good when we see that support. It is a very um, heartwarming thing to know that the Central Florida community comes quickly to the aid of, of folks like this young lady. The cookie thief may have gotten away, but we teamed up with the morning team here at Mix 105.1 to help the Girl Scout out. As a part of uh, the New Six family, we decided to donate uh, $100, so in total that's about $535, awesome. $35 and change. Awesome. A, a great big wad of cash right here that's going to oh go my, look, to, there's that, the cash. to that little girl. So um, Everybody, this, I'm actually looking at the cash. Yeah, this, Scissors County Girl Scout CEO Mary Ann Berry says the troop has not only recovered what was stolen, but also plans to give back. It won't bring the girls down either. They are resilient and brave, and this young lady is a perfect example of that because she has bounced back awesome. beautifully. And even though the money has been recovered, the thief is still out there, and Barry has one piece of advice for him. Hey, stop it. Don't do these things. Figure out what's going on and uh, address it in your life rather than traumatize these kids. If you want information about how to donate, you can go ahead and go to our website, clickorlando.com, powered by News 6, and all that information will be there. Getting results here in Maitland, Johnny Fernandez, News 6.